Thousands of public sector workers have walked off the job in their biggest strike in 20 years. Customs staff at airports around the country are walking off the job this morning amid ongoing pay disputes with the federal government. The CPSU has always been a campaigning union, but over the past 12 months, members, delegates and officials have never had a higher public profile. Rallies like these have been rolling out across the country. The CPSU has already been to Sydney, Perth and Darwin, and Brisbane is in its sights next. These workers are fighting against what they say is a government attack on their workplace rights, conditions and take-home wages. And this is the largest round of industrial action in a generation. CPSU members are hitting the streets, fighting for jobs and services while safeguarding rights, conditions and real wages. The Abbott government has cut over 17,000 jobs and now they're coming after the rights, conditions and real wages of public sector workers. Scientists, meteorologists and accountants were among an unlikely group of workers to take their demands for better pay and conditions to the streets. This is serious industrial action and it does require a serious response from government. The union has been staging half-day strikes across the country and today it was Canberra's turn. At the heart of the issue, cuts to pay and workers' rights. Meteorologists and statisticians aren't known as the most militant of workers. In fact, many claim this is their first time ever on strike. This is my first one. Not surprisingly, they picked up the lingo in no time. Today's rally has caused widespread delays across the southeast, with busloads of union members coming from Toowoomba, the Sunshine Coast, and the Gold Coast. We have border protection officers who face losing five to eight thousand dollars a year in their current take-home pay under this government's policy. These workers have tried everything for over a year and now they're launching serious industrial action to push government to sit down and talk. The queues to get through immigration stretch for 300 metres in both directions. Oh, I'm just pissed off, yeah. It is it disgusting. Not it should not happen at all. It's nuisance. Members have had enough. Centrelink officers were also put under pressure by the strikes. Kudos to them, um, but unfortunately it, it does affect us. There's no way forward with a poor pay offer. I think you can tell a lot about a government by the way it treats its workers. We are prepared to negotiate, we are prepared to compromise, but the government needs to come to the bargaining table and negotiate a sensible and fair outcome. CPSU members are always prepared to get on the front foot and get their message out. Starting tomorrow morning, hundreds of ABC workers are going to get called into the meetings where they get told whether they've got a future, what happens to them, what happens to the work that they do. What happens if we don't have a broadcaster who are separate from corporate interests who have the responsibility of holding the government to account? I like working for DHS because it really gives me a chance every day to make a difference in people's lives. I work with a great team of people and I like to think we're making a positive difference for the Australian community at large. Well Centrelink Medicare and Child Support are part of a department that's been cut too much. What we want to see is more permanent, uh, well-trained uh, staff to deal with the complex issues that people face. Scientists yeah. don't do this, they don't turn out en masse to protest rallies very often, do they? If we can make a contribution here to the better future for all Australians and, and increase awareness, then that's why we're here. We've got an important work to get on with, less and less people to do it, we're suffering. Which is currently working on Hendra virus, SARS, uh, Ebola. Uh, in this time, wouldn't you think that would be such a, a, a thing to keep? We're actually acting together as a collective, and I believe that, yes, this will have an effect. I think it's all about unity already, and numbers. We did not pick this fight, but we will have it, and we will win it.